What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We've got another movie reaction for ya. Mm. The Conjuring 3, The Devil Made Me Do It. <laughs> Shit. I'm good. Shut up. Ready. Shut up. <laughs> Shoulders have survived. A lot of oh bitches. A lot of fun. Love these scary movies with you. Yes. You ready to check out this reaction? Yes. But first, just a reminder, Link down below to our Twitch channel. We do movie nights, and we're doing a lot of scary movie nights, which is just great. <laughs> and a lot more lined up. <laughs> Every weekend, so come join us. That link's down below. Ready for this? Yes. Let's go. Oh, God, I hate it already. <laughs> oh, I hate it already with the fog and shit. The mist. July 18, 1981, Ed and Lorraine Warren were called to document the exorcism of David Glatzel. He was eight years old. Oh, honey. I won't let anything happen to you. Oh, yeah? There's always something kind of creepy about, like, a priest showing up to a house like this at night. Yeah. It's like, well, you're only there for one thing. Oh my god. Oh fuck. Okay. Bitch, no. Bitch, no. Bitch, uh-uh. No, bitch, no. Oh, honey, that's not gonna happen. That's not gonna stop it. Babe, go get someone. Where the fuck is everybody? Oh, come on, no. What the fuck is that shit? No, bitch, no. No, no, bitch. Ah, oh, fuck you. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. Oh my god. Are you for fucking real? What's happening, buddy? Are you okay? What the actual? Leave. <laughs> oh, oh, what? Oh fuck? my god. Ah. Oh shit. Right now. Okay, let's get him down to the car. Oh shit. Right now. Fucking sh oh my god, dude. No fucking way. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> this poor baby. Uh this actor. Child is amazing. Oh, fuck you! What the hell, dude? Whoa, shit! Oh, bitch. Did they fucking open a doorway? Dude, the sounds. What the fuck, dude? Who comes up with this shit? True story, what do you mean? Leave him alone! It takes him! Oh my god. Oh shit. Somebody call 911! Okay. Oh my god. The exorcism of eight-year-old David Gladsell was meant to end months of torment, but for Arnie Johnson, it was just the beginning. The tragic events that followed made nationwide headlines and led Ed and Lorraine Warren to the most sinister discovery of their career based on the true fucking story, bro. I didn't see fucking in there. I added it. I was ad-libbing. The Conjuring. The devil made me do it. Fucking what, bitch? We're gonna need to run a few more tests before I'm comfortable answering that. Yeah, it's kind of hard to, you know, wasn't a natural heart attack. <laughs> it was given to him by a fucking demon. Let me think about it. And so nobody realizes then that now he's possessed? She gets done, you've gotta call the emergency vet. I wrote the number down. Do you notice that? 
Hmm. It started got static mm -hmm. as soon as Arnie walked next to it. Okay. I'll go get the meat. Ow! Oh, <laughs> In the face! <laughs> It starts with just spilling a little cereal. Like seriously, how could you continue to feel comfortable living in a house with those scratch marks everywhere? Mm -hmm. Like that's horrifying shit. Ew! Oh, well, Ugh. see. Oh god. There's Ugh. an explanation for everything. <laughs> it makes just perfect sense. No. 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 Not there yet. <gasps> Bitch! What the fuck is this? Oh, bitch, no! Oh, bitch! That guy was creepy looking. We stood under the gazebo, but my home is here with him. Aw, same! <laughs> Until you never come back from Idaho. <laughs> Deuces, <laughs> bitch! <laughs> Um, I don't think this is a great idea. A chainsaw, a belt, and a tree. I mean, he's Fuck just, no. He's just grooming the tree. No big deal. No, bitch. No. Not when you're possessed by Satan. <laughs> he doesn't know that yet. How do you not know? He said, take me. And Ed's asleep, so Ed, don't, Ed can't say anything. Oh, this bitch in the fucking window. Are you for real? She has a fucking cut off a leg. Hell. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. No, bitch, no. No, mm -mm. nope. Uh uh. No, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> it's got the kid. It's fine. It's over. Arnie. It's got Arnie. No. Fucking wow, dude. The dogs are just like yelling at him. Oh, oh shit. shit. Fucking got me. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, bitch. No. Fuck this. Oh, my God, dude. No. Oh, damn. Stay right there, okay? Oh shit, dude. I think I hurt someone. Bitch! Wow, dude. The court of law. The standards of evidence are completely different. The court accepts the existence of God every time a witness swears to tell the truth. True that. I mean, you know. Do they still make you swear on a Bible? You come over to our house for dinner. We'll show you the evidence we've collected over the years. I would love to visit their room. No, fuck that. You can go by your damn self. I'm not fucking going into that. Mr. Johnson. Oh, bitch. She's fucking scared. <laughs> your Honor, my client pleads not guilty by reason of demonic possession. The judge is like, what? He's like, go fuck yourself. He's gonna go for the death penalty. That kid is gonna either live or die depending on what you two find. Fuck, dude. No pressure. It's just that somebody's life in your hands. <laughs> Young love. Ah, uh, that's a fuck no for me. <laughs> a waterbed, no less. With a mirror. Oh, are you fucking kidding me right now? Mm, we all know what that was bed was for. Mm-hmm. Water bed with a mirror. Two, four other mirrors, too. Uh-uh. No, bitch. Oh, bitch. shit. <laughs> no. 
No. Uh, I gotta go. I gotta go. I can't sit here. I can't. Uh uh. No, bitch. No. No. No, 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 no. Get up. Get the fuck off that bed, kid. Right the fuck now. Get off. 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 Oh my god. Get off. Get off the bed. Oh my god. Ah! You little shit. Oh my god, yo. Are you for fucking real right now? Bitch, no! No, no, mm -mm. no, bitch. He's probably just gonna get yelled at for just playing with the bed. That's a fucking gateway to hell. How do you fucking cover that shit up with a rug? Are you for real? <laughs> gateway to hell. <laughs> Why is it still wet, you assholes? Fuck this. <laughs> Gateway to hell. <laughs> You're a dick, shut up. The guest room's about 15 feet in and to the right. Like, I ain't going down there, bitch. Just hold my purse. That's right, hold my purse, Ed. Like, where's the blowtorch? Just get rid of all those, burn it. <laughs> all those damn spider webs. Fuck this. <laughs> Fuck this. Dude, all the shit that she's been through, she is. She's like immune to it. She's like, crawl under the house. No big deal. Done. You. <laughs> this is scary to me because it like now I have to pee. Like, <laughs> fuck, this is a lot. Those are not the baby rats that I took care of. Those are... Mm -mm, no, bitch. What the fuck is that? Oh, no. Mm -mm. No. Nope. No, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> it's actively wet. The fuck? Oh, shit. Got a new toy for the, for the trophy case. Bitch, no. No. Bitch. Nope. Could you imagine finding something like that underneath your house? No. <sighs> kind of makes you want to look. <laughs> we don't have a crawl space. I know, but like anywhere we have an hidden. Attic, though. Anywhere hidden somewhere in the house. <laughs> we do have an attic. So it's above us right now. Yeah. Oh, this guy looks super sus. Didn't hear the car driving. Dude, this is fucking the guy from Poltergeist. Carol Ann! Let me in! Oh, bitch, no. He's definitely been through some things. You're all gonna die! As he screams through the screen door. What does this tell you about the person who made it? They're crazy! I'm still not gonna be able to get the gateway to hell comment out of my head. Shut up reason you're here oh bitch why you tell me man his baby was born six weeks early with its heart outside of its body oh fuck his wife committed suicide by laying her neck on a railroad track what this boy is headed to the death chamber i couldn't imagine with like lorraine's ability to like read and feel things because of her like medium powers what she felt in that room. She looked so uneasy the whole time she was there. I'm not going under there. I don't want to. I'm good. Oh, bitch, no. Fuck that. Oh, shit. Damn it! Was this person alive? Katie's body was found near here, stabbed 22 times. Oh shit. 
the devil worshippers, they're just people. Crazy evil people, but people. Oh, bitch. You missed a turn. The spot where you found Katie's body. <laughs> bitch, no! Look, I'm fine. Totally fine. This kid's like, no, you're not, buddy. I mean, he looks terrible. I remember what it felt like. You're always cold. Is this kid from Hell House? Afraid she won't be able to do it? I'm afraid that she will. This is terrifying. I mean, Blair Witch forever changed the idea of walking through the woods. Yeah. Oh, bitch. Oh, no. Oh, Lorraine. No, uh-uh. When they do that, okay, no. Nope. I mean, that was a really cool transition. <laughs> See, this is why when our friends ask us to go camping, <laughs> fuck that, no. Uh-uh, mm -mm. nope, mm -mm. no thank you. No thank you, who are you? No, bitch. Oh, God. Damn it. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Fuckers. It's like, how does Lorraine, like, live her life? Honestly. Like, could you imagine? No. Doing, like, the way she experiences these things is just insane. <gasps> no! Bitch! No! What the fuck? Dude, how is he going to be okay doing this? She's down there. Oh my god, dude. You said this was over, but now he's trapped in there with this thing, and it's telling him to kill himself. Oh, damn, dude. But I think that I was connected to the person who's responsible for this. And that connection could still be open. What? There's got to be another way. What are they going to, like, do a fucking seance with a dead body? This poor kid. Bitch. Oh, God. Poor Ed. Just getting dragged along for this. Ed! <laughs> Leave a note. Dude! <laughs> I fucking love, I love them together though, like so much. They're like perfect for each other. They are. Oh boy. Oh, I don't like this shit at all. And no ma'am. Would they normally leave bodies out like this in 1981? Oh, it's wet. You best believe that's fucking her. Don't bodies that they find in water, aren't they like bloated and stuff? If her foot starts twitching, I'm gonna lose it. What if I start twitching? I'm gonna fucking kill you! Uh. Girl! What? 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 Oh, fuck my life. Oh, God, dude. No. <laughs> I can't do this shit. Mm -hmm. What have I done to myself by opening... Oh, an upside down crown. That's super fun. I love it so much. You best believe I'm having fucking nightmares after this shit. Well, she didn't sleep after Conjuring 2, so... A train horn? We have a train down the fucking street. And there's a fucking train horn in this bullshit? Nah, bitch. Lorraine. Oh, there's not a timer. Oh, fuck this. She's trying to complete the curse. Oh, no, no. No, don't do it. Don't, no, no, no. Oh, damn. Oh, my God. 
Oh no, she's pissed. Oh, she's gonna be fucking pissed. The connection works both ways. Fuck that shit. Oh, bitch. If she started talking to me like that, I'd be like, I made a mistake. I turned, made the wrong turn. Just bye. Nice to meet you. What <gasps> oh the my hell? God. Oh no. Oh no. Oh hell oh, no. no. Oh. Ed's heart can't handle this right now. Like what is, like, come on. <gasps> no, 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 no. Oh my god, dude. Oh my the god. The fucking eye, you see that shit? Oh, fuck this, dude. Fuck this shit. All day. The church used it to identify and persecute witchcraft. We don't have any overhead lighting. Right. <laughs> you can break the curse by destroying the altar it was cast from. There's a connection there. Let me take a look at the, take a look at the, take a look at the. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Bitch, no, not Ed. He's been pushing himself pretty freaking hard. With everything, like, they've experienced, they just kind of just, like, brush it off, like, ah, been there, done that. Oh, fuck this bitch. Where is she? You know, the two of you have gathered quite the collection. Bitch. Uh-uh. No. Oh my god, no. What the what fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, dude. Oh no. No, no, no. Oh, what? And it was her. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, bitch. Does that mean like the curse like transferred to them? Come in. This is bad. This is bad. This is real, real bad. I mean, what part of this has been good so far? Why did he lock the door? Why did he just lock the door? Something I need to show you. Why? I don't I don't want to go anywhere with you, sir. Rain run. I have something to show you. It's my murder basement. This fucking creepy ass motherfucker just like walks away. See, I fucking told you polter poltergeist all day on this shit. You fucking scary motherfucker. Hell no. Dude just chilling in the dark, dude. Whatever, man. Our happiness filled this house. Does this turn out to be the bitch that's fucking terrorizing and shit? Why do I feel like that's exactly where it's going? It. Hmm. Fascination. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Fuck this, dude. Nope. Nope. She's my daughter. Bitch! After all these years, I thought she'd come back to me again. Oh, I'm pretty sure this biatch is too far gone now. Fuck this shit, dude. I'm not going. Uh-uh. No, bitch, no. Please, God, don't let me fail. <gasps> Oh my god. Um, Lorraine, I think it's time to run, girlfriend. Run to where? I don't know. Um, this storage facility sucks. <laughs> what? Of course she's got floodlights, bitch. Oh my god. Oh shit, that's cement in it. Oh fuck. Oh, I hit it. I hate it. I hate it so much. I hate it so much. I hate it so much. Oh my god, she's walking. She's fucking watching you, dude. And she's got a fucking knife, huh? What the fuck? Look at me. Oh my 
my god, dude. No, no, no. I don't want to look at you, bitch. Oh, god damn. Open your eyes. No, no. I'm good. Thank you so much. No, no, no. Oh, my god, bitch. Oh, you fucking nuts. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my god. Oh, I can't. I can't sit here for this. <gasps> the fucking eye. Ah. Um, Ed? Dude. <gasps> no! No! Oh my, I hate it. Oh my god. Oh my god. <gasps> What's happening? No. No. Obviously, bro. <laughs> the sounds are so nasty. I don't think this father is up to the task. Our father, the Lord in heaven, our Lord be the Oh, oh shit. fuck. For deliver us from the earth, for mine is the kingdom. Oh, shit, dude. Yes! Oh shit, dude. Oh, fucking wow, man. You could burn that dude's house down. I don't care if you destroy the altar or not. Oh, what are they gonna add to the Look at that fucking picture, dude. Seriously. Fuck that picture, man. Oh, hail to the gnaw. I they, hate it. Are they keeping the totem there? It's a hell of a collection. And there's Annabelle. Fuck Just that. Just chilling in the background. It's like, yeah, bitches, I was cursed. The devil made me do it. I remember 24th, 1981, Arnie Johnson was convicted on the charge of manslaughter. Arnie served five years. He married Debbie while in prison. Aww. They're still married to this day. Aww, he made her a gazebo. That was a really entertaining movie. I mean, it was obviously very different than the other movies because this was like a murder investigation. They had to like try to prove the demon possession caused the murder and all that stuff where the other two movies were clear like we got to go in and Take care cast it out and do this and that just like the other two movies the acting is phenomenal just it, it makes it feel so believable it is so well done just everything about it is just like the sound effects the the way it's filmed the camera angles just I, I I'm really 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 into these these movies. I don't like sitting here because I feel like something's gonna touch my feet. <laughs> like something's gonna grab us from under the desk. Yes, dude, my fucking feet are like dangling under here. Dude. I don't want to do this anymore. Yeah, I, I this whole series has been super entertaining. There's no more of the Conjuring ones, right? We're done with the Conjuring this is, ones. We're caught up on the Conjuring. I don't know what the plans are in Ugh. terms of doing more Conjuring movies, but there's other Apparently movies. we need to watch Sinister and Sidious and... Well, Annabelle and there's all other... The, all the things. There's other movies in the Conjuring universe that we need to decide if we're going to watch or not, but... I, I keep seeing some shit! I'm not sleeping! I'm not sleeping I mean, ever again! You didn't sleep well after watching two. You left the TV on all night, which you never do. Lots of solid shots. I hate you. I think... <laughs> did this movie scare the shit out of you? Like the other two? It was pretty scary. I mean, the the whole... Th it's not even like the jump scares or whatever. It's the unknown. It's yeah. the stuff you can't see. I feel like the other two were scarier because it was more a demon living in a place possessing people versus a singular person casting this spell out. Like, there was... It's just, it's more sickening that a person would do this to other people but the, versus a spirit kind of consuming you. The whole idea you. is though that, that people are out there being evil. See that? People are out there being like, you know what, Satan? 
Best idea I've ever had. <laughs> what do you say? I mean, I'm just putting this out there. What if I give you three souls, you give me some shit? What do you think? Deal? I mean, I Let's think I think that's why it goes <laughs> to my I think that's why it goes back to my explanation of what scares me more. The idea of a person doing that feels more real, hence doesn't scare me as much. Versus but people are scary. But just the idea that a demon could be opening our door and coming and choking us, like just because is don't because like, now I, like, ah, I can't do this. Dude. That's scarier to me. The idea that just someone was like killed in this house and they can't go rest in peace, so they're gonna haunt the people that live there. Like that's scarier because that feels more out there. I don't know. It's just kind of how. My mind works with scary things. I think people are scarier than most things. I guess the my mindset is like law of averages. What's the chances that somebody would want to like cast a curse out to me? Like, I don't know. We, I mean, I'm sure we've got haters. I mean, I guess being on the <laughs> internet increases that percentage a little bit than being nothing. But I mean, I just who, I'm just like no hate, one's gonna. Who can hate this troll? I'm like I'm. <laughs> It's just my mindset where it's like, no one's going to... Now everyone's going to try to curse me. They're going to get like little voodoo dolls. Can we not? Let's not do that. Thanks. But that's kind of where my mindset goes. Like, this movie was very well done. I don't think it was as scary as the previous two. I think overall my favorite was the first one. Because I just feel like the pacing was a little bit better. And obviously it being the first one, you don't necessarily know exactly what you're getting into. And yeah, I felt like that first one was the scariest and... I think my, I like the story of this one a little more because it was a little different. Yeah. But yeah, I think overall, I think I like the first one the best. Ugh. If you could pick which one. I don't, I mean, I'm never going to look at 3.07 a.m. <laughs> well, the same ever again. Right? I mean, I hope they make more of these just because the the stories and the way they do it and Ed and Lorraine are just so fascinating. Like the way they're portrayed in these in these movies are just it's. I love their love story. Yeah, that I mean me they're very romantic, and it's like I feel like there's the only way that they could live like this and have a career in that world is to be that close to each other. Oh my you god! Know? Yeah, like they couldn't they couldn't ever fight because it'd feel like the hate or the anger or whatever emotions would just bring in just whatever's living in that room. Yeah. Annabelle would come crawling out and be like, Oh, you called? <laughs> I heard y'all are fighting. Like, <laughs> but yeah, Let me put an end to that fight. Like, the way they're portrayed in these movies, I, I think that's fantastic. And it's just, it's so much fun. And overall, I, I'm really, really happy that we actually watched these. So You're welcome. Do you have any other thoughts? No. All right. Leave your comments down below. We'll see you guys later. Have a good one. Bye.